Time for one last story. Mad Summer Night's Dream by Ruth Brown. One midsummer night in winter when snow lay on the ground. From miles away inside my head I heard an eerie sound. I went down to the cellar to look from an upstairs room. The flowers were singing sweetly. The birds were in full bloom. Quite clearly in the distance, but almost out of sight, two fat cats were yowling, preparing for a fight. They were staring at each other while sitting back to back. One was black with brown stripes. The brown one's stripes were black. Three stone monkeys sprang to life and danced around with glee. The blind one said, I volunteer to be the referee. He said he'd watch the hissing cats to supervise fair play. The silent monkey by his side screeched, That will be the day! The other monkey next to him, for he would keep the score, said he would keep the score, for though he couldn't hear a thing, he'd heard it all before. But as they started fighting, the walls came tumbling down. The cats fell into a dried up ditch. I feared that they might drown. I jumped right in to save them and heard a piercing scream. It woke me up. And it was morning. What a mad midsummer night's dream! That was Mad Summer Night's Dream by Ruth Brown. This is Brooklyn Blowback TV. Thank you all for tuning in. It has been my sincere pleasure to have been entertaining you since August 2002 with short stories of relevance to each and every one of us. Brooklyn Blowback TV. The world in a snow globe.